Monitor arms are one of the most essential ergonomic upgrades you can make to your desk, and this Vivo monitor arm delivers on its promise. Let's talk about it. I'm sure you've seen these around. There's hundreds of options out there, and for good reason. Monitor arms can help eliminate back pain, neck pain, eye strain, especially for extended sessions in front of the computer. And in this day and age, let's face it, we're at our desks longer and longer. Beyond the ergonomic benefits, they also just look great and they free up extra desk space for all sorts of activities. For my part, I use an ultra-wide monitor, which means I've had to be extra careful when picking a brand to make sure it wasn't going to collapse on me. <laughs> now, with so many options out there, I was initially paralyzed for which to go with. So if you're watching this, you might've been here too. This is one of those things I definitely didn't want to skimp on, but I also didn't want to break the bank either. So I finally just went for it and I am so glad that I did. In my opinion, Vivo makes one of the best bang for buck options out there. Now Vivo or Vivo, I don't really know how to pronounce it. Well, they make loads of different monitor arms, but this pneumatic version specifically offers the best value in its category. In previous older videos of mine, you may have seen a different arm. Now that was also made by Vivo. And while it worked at freeing up the desk space, it didn't really end up helping with straining as it wasn't really that adjustable. It was locked at its height once I set it up. So even though it looked good, I decided I needed to upgrade in order to gain those main benefits. Not to mention that I was constantly worried about its stability since it didn't have a huge base plate and only had a single screw for the clamp. Whereas this other one from Vivo designed for larger monitors has two huge screws and a very sizable base plate. And again, this premium heavy duty one is adjustable in nearly any way you could possibly imagine. It's got a 45 degree tilt, 180 degree swivel, 180 degree rotation, 13 inches of height adjustment, and overall I can swing it around pretty maniacally. That said, for my purposes, I'm only ever really adjusting the height and tilt and occasionally the rotation. If my desk is in standing mode, I can easily raise the height. And if I wanna move it out of the way for some reason, I can do that. Now this arm can hold up to 33 pounds in weight. And for reference, this Alienware 34 inch monitor is only 15 pounds. So the weight capacity is pretty incredible. Vivo says this arm can actually support monitors as large as 49 inches, which I think is just, it's just insane. And I know with its beefy construction, my expensive monitor isn't just gonna fall over and get destroyed. I also love that this monitor arm has integrated cable management, helping keep the desk looking nice and tidy. And it's amazing once it's done. I will say though that the cable management was a bit of a pain. I did nick my hand on the edge trying to get that base plate off. So when you're doing that, just be more careful than me because I've been known to do dumb things from time to time. As I've mentioned now a few times, I found the overall construction to be incredibly durable. It's beefy and very sturdy. They do make a white version, but I chose to go with the black version. I like the finish of this as it's super well machined and has a sort of matte look. I initially disliked the Vivo logo on the base plate, but it's not as jarring in person. That said, I still cover it with a little desk trinket. So in order to figure out if this is gonna work with your monitor, you didn't make sure your monitor weighs under 33 pounds and has compatibility with one of the two Visa brackets, either 75 by 75 millimeters or 100 by 100 millimeters mounting capability. There are two mounting options in terms of getting this thing onto the desk. There's either grommet installation, which involves drilling a hole into your desk, or the easier option, which is installing a seat clamp. For this, you just need to clamp it to the side of your desk and twist the screws until the grip is extremely tight. Pro tip, for additional sturdiness, consider an extra piece of wood underneath the desk to give it a firmer base grip. Honestly, if you follow the instructions exactly and take your time, you're not gonna encounter any issues assembling this. It took me like an hour, hour and a half or so, and I was being very careful. The scariest part of the process by far was mounting the monitor actually onto the arm itself. It's just, it's just very scary. So I'd actually recommend having an extra person to help or being very, very careful and support the monitor underneath as well as above. And I just had a pillow under my desk just in case it tipped forward. Also, while you're setting it up, there's a neat little feature adjustment which lets you lock the bottom rotation at 90 degrees. This means it's going to stop the monitor arm from spitting into your wall. So now after having this installed on my desk for like about a week, I can honestly say, I don't know why I waited so long to do this. While the included stand was fine, it just didn't adjust nearly as much and took up so much desk space. Now when I'm sitting in gaming, I can adjust the screen to be farther away from me so I can lean back and enjoy. When I need to be focused for longer writing sessions, I can bring it forward to my eye level and sit comfortably while typing for long hours. And when I wanna do just general computing tasks, I can raise the desk, raise the height and stay locked in without any straining. Plus sometimes it's just fun to move around if I find myself watching a video and wanna just kick back more. Now, while there are a lot of monitor arms to choose from, I found Vivo's brand reliability and this particular model's ergonomic benefits to offer the best value against the competition. 
For example, Ergotron, which is by far one of the best known brands in this space, their competing model is almost double the price and I can't find any reason to spring for that over this one. Now I knew going into this project, it was going to make a difference, but I really didn't realize how much of a difference it was gonna make. If you've been looking for ways to freshen up your desk or office space and you've been on the fence, I don't think you need to be any longer. Again, I really just don't know why I didn't do this sooner. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button for the algorithm and consider subscribing if you wanna see more reviews like this. It helps the channel out immensely. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.